It's not unusual to be loved by anyone. And welcome to Early Morning Talks with Joel. Today we will be discussing a very important and popular topic, Confederation. This topic has been debated by many politicians, and today we will have two special guests to share their opinions on Confederation. We will announce the guests right after the break. Please welcome our first guest, Sir John A. McDonald. Salutations. <laughs> so how are you, Mr. McDonald? Please, call me John. All right then, John. Um, so what are your thoughts on Confederation? Oh, I'm definitely fighting for Confederation. Our economy would be stable, and tariffs and trade barriers would be abolished. So right now I hear you're the chairman of the London Conference. Yes. The London Conference is still in session. At the moment, New Brunswick, Nova Scotia, Upper and Lower Canada are part of the conference. That's very interesting. And if you don't mind, I'd like to bring out your good friend right after the break. I've got the wine. I've got the cheese. Come by with 50% off. Please welcome our next guest, Travis Dyson McKinney. I know, it was very unfortunate. Although I was part of the Charlottetown Conference, which was a major leading factor towards the London Conference. Oh, why is that? Well, the Charlottetown Conference was originally to discuss the Maritime Union. The Intercolonial Railway was to connect the Maritime Colonies with the province of Canada. Okay, thank you for sharing. Um, now that we've heard from these two gentlemen, we'll be having somebody call in with a different opinion on Confederation after the break. Put Sam for your horses here. It will make it longer and shorter. Buy that at your local marketplace for only $5.99. It will show you keep your horses. Hi, welcome back to the show. We currently have a special guest on hold to ask him his opinions. Hi. Hello. Mr. Howe, I hear you have a very interesting perspective on Confederation. Would you like to share? Well said, my friend. You're saying Confederation would not help the economy, but technically speaking, it would. The Intercolonial Railway will connect the colonies, which would help trade, which obviously would help the economy. And help save money. Yes. Because I think, in my opinion, there are more pros to confederation than cons. haired bow, the textures and the real gold coat and silver coat, all this beautiful sound only at Bob's Royal Music Academy. Go get them now before they're all out. Would you two like to add on to anything before the show? Like, why should not New Brunswick take part in Confederation? Well, have you not seen how much debt New Brunswick has been in? The only way to get out of that is to become a union. The only way to prevent the Americans from coming over and taking over is if we become a confederation and become one whole country. Right. I totally agree with you. I totally agree too. Okay. Great. Thank you guys for coming so much. Thank you. And now we'll have Sarah McCartney interviewing random people outside of the streets on their thoughts of confederation. Here we are on the streets of New Brunswick asking people their opinion. If if New Brunswick should be a part of Confederation. Here we found Mr. Tilly. Let's go ask him his opinion. Mr. Tilly, Mr. Tilly. Oh, hello. 
Mr. Charlie, do you think Confederation should be a part of New Brunswick? Yes, I do think that Confe Confederation should be a part of New Brunswick because there are just so many benefits. Like, there would be stops, there wouldn't be any more Fenian raids at all, and there would be a conjoining railway from St. John to Montreal. Thank you so much for your input. Britain should never form a union with Ireland. All the Britain people are just gonna control us. Yeah, I totally agree. We should finish this by finishing the people that started this. Yeah, same with me. Okay, let's do this. shot and killed outside his doorsteps. Follow us for more information. No, why'd you die? Don't do this to me! Don't die on me! Don't die! Alright, that's our show, everybody. <laughs> Many benefits. Oh, sorry. Originally. <laughs> To discuss the maritime union, <coughs> the intercolonial was. Clean <laughs> <coughs> 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 water! Was <coughs> over.